Hey guys, and welcome to my first request for Say It With Your Chest. So thank you guys for joining in with me on this. And someone sent me an email with a question. And my email address will be in the beauty bar below. This is a generic email. It's not my regular email. I created an email address just for this, just so you know. So someone said, what do you do when you have a problem with the baby mama who won't let the dad see the kids? So you can ask me a question or you can tell me your situation and we'll comment on it. In that situation, let me tell you something, okay? I've been in a similar situation, and I feel like the reason that the baby mama won't let him see his kids is because, one, she still cares about him, or two, she's still scorned by whatever he did to her, whatever they broke up, whatever he did to her, whether it's been three years, four years, 10 years, 15 years. If she's acting stupid, she either still cares about him so she's acting stupid to make his life a living hell. Or she's a woman scorned by what was done in their relationship. Okay. And I'm a baby mama twice over. I'm going to tell y'all that. Okay. I got two baby daddies. Okay. My second baby daddy I was married to for 13 years. 13 years. I left him. He met somebody else. He didn't have another baby. Do you think I care? 13 years of marriage. I'm not stalking him. I'm not calling him. I'm not saying you can't see your kids. I'm not out there acting crazy. I'm not acting stupid when you call. Yeah. You have these women that weren't even married to these men acting stupid. You have women that dated men for two or three years, had one or two kids from them out there acting stupid. No, you can't see your kids. No, you can't do this. No, you can't do that. They just stupid. They either still care about them or they still hurting. And they need to get over that hurt because the only person they're hurting is themselves. This is what you tell your baby daddy. If she won't let you see the kids, if you're paying child support, go to court. Get visitation. Every time she don't let you see them, file a police report. Violate her. Okay, if you're not paying child support, then just move on. It's very hard to say move on when you have kids. And I understand that because I am a mother. But sometimes you got to let that junk go. Okay, it's fathers out here that don't care about their kids, don't care whether they see their kids, don't even know who all are their kids. And these men out here that are trying to be in their kids life, these women are jackasses. And that's basically just what it is. So if you get mad, you get mad. You can click off the video now. You a jackass. Because you're hurting those kids, the relationship with those kids and their father. You think you're doing something for yourself, but you're not. Nine out of ten times, if he backs off, that woman going to drop them kids off. Okay? Or if he backs off, when they get 18, 19 years old, he can contact them himself. Hey, let's talk. Let me tell you what happened. Let me tell you why I wasn't there. And if they want to forgive them, they do. And if they don't, they don't. But there is nothing you can do about a dumb baby mama. They just dumb for no reason. Just dumb. Okay, the problem with baby mamas is they feel like they have a place. They feel like I'm the baby mama so I can call at 10, 11, 12 o'clock. I'm the baby mama so I can stop by whenever I want to. I'm the baby mama so I can do this. I'm the baby mama so I can do that. I have his kids so I can do that. Let me tell you something. Here's a real eye opener for the baby mamas because I'm a baby mama twice over. Listen now, come in close because I don't want y'all to miss this. You are just what you are. Just a baby mama. That's all you are. Because if you were relevant, you would still be with that man. Why are you acting stupid? It's not going to change anything. He's still going to be with who he's with. He's still going to live his life. Stop acting stupid. Let them kids see their daddy. Unless that other woman is mistreating them kids or the daddy is mistreating them kids, let them kids see their daddy. Because you're only hurting them. You're not hurting him. You see, what I had to learn in life is sometimes you have to walk away from people. Sometimes you have to walk away. People are in your life for a season. Okay? And yes, kids too. Sometimes you sleep with the wrong woman. Sometimes you lay down with the wrong woman. We ain't supposed to be sleeping together before marriage anyways. Okay? Sometimes you sleep with the wrong woman, get the wrong woman pregnant, and sometimes you just got to walk away, mail them kids some money every month, and when they get old enough, holler at them. Because half of these women were not wives. Half of these women were not even girlfriends. Okay? They was just somebody that man was sleeping with, a girl on the side, or he was doing his thing and now they in their feelings. That's it. Bottom line. 
if a baby mama is acting stupid, doing stupid stuff, or whatever, she either still cares about him or she still scorned. That's it. There's no other explanation behind it. Baby mamas can be dumb as hell. And I've experienced that. They're just dumb. And see, I'm different because I don't play. You could come for me. You can come for me. I don't play. Okay, I'm a baby mama twice over and my husband has a baby mama. You could come for me. Because the things that you're doing are stupid. The things that you're doing are based on y'all relationship. What happened in y'all relationship is not based on anything else. Now, if he a deadbeat dad, that's different. Okay, she didn't say he was a deadbeat dad. But if he a deadbeat dad and he don't do nothing and he want to come get the kids, I still say a man should be allowed to see his kids. If he a deadbeat dad, do you, do what you want to do. You may feel like he don't have any rights to do so. But if he's doing what he's supposed to do and you just acting stupid because you wearing your feelings on your chest, you need to stop. You need to stop. Bottom line. All right? Hit me up at that email down below. We're going to say it with our chest.